Come, come with me. <laughs> okay. Come with me on a journey. Is it recording? Yeah. We are about to go on a trip from Turkey to Batumi, Batumi, Georgia. Why are we taking this trip? Okay, because I'm so smart. I think I overstayed my Turkish visa. So we're doing 20 hours on a bus to Georgia, to are the you, Black Sea region. Are you ready for 20 hours? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yes. So this is packed up. We're ready to go. So let's go. <laughs> That's gotta be right. <laughs> That's not right. Where are we now? Tell me where we're. Yeni Kapı. Yeni Yeah. That's the name of the neighborhood. Yeah, it's like pretty, pretty ghetto, as you can see. No, it's not. You say something's ghetto in Turkey. Everything is ghetto, ghetto in Turkey. Barely. Excited about this trip? Yeah, I'm excited to go back to my roots. Really? <laughs> really? Okay. This should be yeah. fun. I yeah. can't wait. It's a nice city. It's a nice little resort city. Tell me what's the first thing I should do when I go there that you liked last time you were there. Well, definitely you should like take a stroll down the main square because they have like colorful buildings and stuff. And the last time I was there, I got drunk on their little spirits. Really? I don't remember what it was called. But it just one shot and I was like blind. Really? It's, it's you don't super know the strong. name? I don't remember the name. It was something funny. It's like Ratu? Yeah, but stronger. Mm. So that one and their bread. I like their bread a lot. It's right. like the salty type of bread. I like it. Yes. Those are the Sounds stuff good. that I remember that. Yeah. Alright. Well, you heard the lady. That's what I'm gonna do. Get drunk, drink bread. Drink bread. <laughs> and, and, it's already drunk. <laughs> I messed it up. <laughs> Eat bread and visit the town square. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So we got on this bus, and then I get in my seat, and my seat goes back, and back, and back, and back, and back, and the lady behind me is just getting cut. So we're trying to get it fixed on her seat, but I don't, I don't think it's going too well. Oh, he can open up the seat yeah. like this. Seat surgery. What do you think about Turkish roadside food? Turkish roadside food is just as good as normal Turkish food, which is magnifique. What do you have? I had rice and beans separately when I joined them. Some spinach or collard greens, as we call them in the States here. We got some beef and some potatoes and carrots. And this is what I got. It's like some beef stew and with rice. And of course, my favorite, yogurt. Seen something like this before? It looks like an airport. It looks like an airport. The moment.
moment of truth. This is where, this is the end of the video, or just the beginning of this journey. We're at the we're at passport control. We're gonna find out whether I'm gonna go to Lingo Lingo Land, Turkish jail, <laughs> or stay on my visa. Let's find out. All right. Are you cool. scared? Am I scared? Do I look scared? I'm terrified. Mm -hmm. Time to get banged up a Look at that. Isn't that scary? Have you ever seen something? Like Let me. <laughs> they even got scratches. People are scratching. Like, hey, I'll take this. This is dumb. So, I entered Turkey on October 10th, 2021. It is now 2022, and I'm leaving on March 3rd, and I'm paying 2,000 something lira to leave. Exactly, 202160 Turkish Lira to leave. So for any travelers who overstay your visa, I hope this helps you out to figure out your situation. But don't overstay your visa, follow the law. Welcome to Georgia, my friend. Welcome, welcome to Georgia. Say hello, Georgia. Hello, Georgia. <laughs> We're gonna take a thousand Turkish Lira and convert it into Georgian currency. Okay, for 1,000 we got how much back? Tell us. 2,004. So for 1,000 we got 2,004. 204, sorry. 204, I love your numbers. I like it. Really windy outside here in Georgia today. I know there's a lot of color on the buildings. Got some gray skies here today. They just let us right in. We just walked up to the hotel. There was a lady outside. She said, come in and just let us inside the building. It was kind of odd. <laughs> bunch of Georgian pastries and snacks and alcohol and of course I've seen this before when people talk about Georgia but totally forgot the name right now looks delicious this is from the stores you saw earlier so I'm gonna try it out this is me trying Georgian food or Georgian bread for the first time Georgian bread for the first time I don't know how to eat it I'm gonna just fold it like a pizza I want more I want more. That's good. That was, boom, that was really good. I love cheese, I love bread. I'm American, that's like, you know, so that's what we eat. This is really good. Really soft, really flaky, really flavorful. Definitely not good for you, <laughs> but it's good to you. I like it. I like the cheese. It's a bit salty, but I like it. 
Okay. So we also picked up this thing. They told us it was filled with beans. Looking at it, the consistency reminds me of chikofte, a Turkish um, spread. I call it a spread. Anyway, it's let's. Not. <laughs> it's not a spread. Um, <laughs> well, let's try this. This reminds me of in America, like we have refried beans, bean dip, so bean paste. And this is just bread with bean paste in it, which is good. This is probably very filling. This is really fill you up for the day. It's good. I like it. I like it. I like the bread more, but this is cool. You want to try it? You ready? Mmm. Mmm. Oh, you really like it. It has like different spices inside. I didn't taste all that. I didn't I get, can smell it. I didn't get that deep. Give it a... What do you give it? I'll give it a 9 out a of 10. A 9 out of 10. Okay, nice. Okay, what do we have here? All right, so we picked up this because it looks like uh, maybe a meat. It will definitely is meat, but it looks like there's different spices. Kind of reminds me of Turkish kebab. Like yeah, it looks the... like a kebab wrapped in a bread, toasted a bit. Let's see how it goes. I'm going to taste it. It's good. It's good. Is it better than a kebab? No. <laughs> no. Thank God. Turkish people do meat really, really well. You can't really beat Turkish people with meat. But this is like a good snack. This is a good snack. I shouldn't be speaking with my mouth open. <laughs> it's okay. The only thing with meat, I like meat with like at least tomatoes or some onions. This is just meat with the... I think it this has some onions. onions, parsley, and then some also pomegranate seeds. Mm. This could use a bit more for me, but hey, we got this at the grocery store. Yeah. This is way better than what you can get at an American grocery store, so. At least, <laughs> well, yeah, at least far as like little dinner food, so this is good. I wonder what this is called, but this is good. So this looks like a pastry, and I was told filled with egg and cheese. Let's take a bite. I think I'll take a bite out of the middle because there's probably most of it here. Mmm, that's really good. That's really good. Love the cheese. I like the Georgian cheese. My egg. I don't know if there's egg yolk in there or if it's just egg white, but it's really baked in. Really good. Really flavorful. Really filling. That's good. A lot of butter. Mm, so, good. what is your favorite pastry out of the three? Because right I'm not counting the little snack meat thing. Really, I was about to say that. But that's that's not pastry. Okay. That's just like a. I mean, this is good. This is really good. One of these is probably breakfast, honestly. One of these with some juice or coffee. That's a good breakfast. Fill it, fill you up. This bread thing is really good too. The bean thing is not bad. It's just not my favorite. This is really good though. Okay. This. More bean for me. Oh man, go ahead. For only ten ninety nine, any woman can be yours. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, yeah, this is a Georgian red semi-sweet wine from Alzani Valley. Okay, now Georgian people, if you're in the comments, if you're watching this video, listen, we just picked up like whatever bottle first, you know, because we hear your wine is famous. Don't kill us because this is like cheap or and, shitty wine. <laughs> and, and because we're drinking from plastic cups. And we're drinking from plastic cups. We're just trying it out, you know, we're here to explore. Yeah. <laughs> it is semi-sweet. That's a very good description. Ooh. <laughs> We're looking at some Ascanelli. Ascanelli Georgian uh, brandy. Um, let's see at the back. Authentic. I like this script. Little scribbly lines. This is a brandy. This brandy is blended of two-year-old alcohols made in famous regions of Georgia. The brandy rich amber color characterizes characterized by fine bouquet with rape and herb tones. The taste of brandy is full. One eternity later. Stop. Nobody cares about that. Drink yeah, it. Nobody cares. I'm gonna just drink it.
No brandy expert is gonna watch this channel. They're not gonna be like, <laughs> he knows his stuff. <laughs> So tell me, as a brandy lover, what do you think? Definitely, people are gonna kill me for this in the comments. Definitely like Hennessy. Definitely, that's like Hennessy. Good morning. <laughs> How are you feeling? I woke up this morning at Dennis with and stopped rhyming, singing, dancing, assaulting me. Tickling me. I slept really well, even though this Georgian bed is super, super, duper hard. <laughs> you can't see it, but this shit is like a rock. It's really yeah. tough. But I, I had my posture never felt better. They're like Stalin. <laughs> Like a burrick. Mmm, there's like meat pieces inside. What would be, what would you call this in Turkey? Burrick. This is burrick. Oh. Yeah. I'm not really a fan of cold stuff, but it's good. It's good. I want you to try the eggplant thing. What eggplant thing? This one. This? Yeah. That's eggplant. Yeah. I thought that it looks like chocolate. I liked that one when I was here last time a lot. Did you try it now? No. I'm starting to like eggplant more and more. This is okay. This is good. Yeah. Generally not a fan of cold stuff, but this is all good. I think you have yogurt on your beard. I have yogurt on my beard. Yeah. Try to drink. Is it, or is it just juice? Let's see. Then that's cranberry. Sure. Let's go for this. You know, this is chocolate. <laughs> Come here, chocolate. This is honey, I think. Mm -hmm. I love this. Black sea. I really want to see the Black Sea at this point. Where are we? That's the apocalypse. They have the weirdest design for the most unnecessary building. shirt <laughs> any way you wear clothes <laughs>
Do I have anything for hair? For my hair? Uh, uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. All right. Thank you. How do you say thank you in Georgian? Madlova. Huh? Madlova. 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 Yes. Madlova. What'd you get? Like I don't know. <laughs> like you don't know. Just picked up a black hat, general black hat. Can't go wrong with that. Yeah. Cool color scarf. Cool color scarf. This a is total. a pretty cool store. Total. Hold on, wait. Get the total. The name of the store is Avantindil. Avantindil. How do you say it? Avantindil. Yeah. Uh, on Instagram. Okay. What's it? Is it Avantindil at Instagram? Out until 73. Okay. okay. Yeah. It was cool. I like this story. Yeah. Total was uh, 210. That's some good stuff. The way they take it is. You like. <laughs> give it to me. Okay, so what not to do in Batumi, Georgia. Number one, first rule, don't come in March or February or winter, or winter in general, unless you want to get wet, unless you're trying to get wet. And even if it's raining, you don't think you could go out and just like, you know, make it make it you know because we we're, we're, we're going back to the hotel now to change our clothes because we're that soaked but you know it's the adventure and uh i still had fun yeah mm, that's number one so just remember that w winter is just not the time but still co some cool stuff to see and do burned himself with hot water. Yeah. <laughs> that was peak Simon. Uh, I should have been recording. That was peak Simon. Oh, uh, excuse me, I need to... <laughs> <laughs> I was translating on the phone, boiling coffee, hot water falls in my leg. You look hot in this shirt. <sighs> well, you know, somebody picked it out for me. Never would have had it if somebody didn't say, ooh, pick this. It looks ugly. Because <laughs> the uglier the shirt, the more Better it's worth. Better it looks. No, it has to run. The <laughs> uglier the shirt, the more it's worth. Badagoni is the name of the wine brand. Badagoni. It's all in Georgian, so we don't know much else. <clears throat> but I guess the name of this product is Red Four. Georgian wine. Trying to make it home, but the ism still lives in a war zone. I'm just trying to get out the fight, but the ism is still trying to take my life. I'm just trying to make it home, but the ism still lives in a war zone. 
I'm just trying to take my life, but the ism still is trying to take my life. So cute. That's what I have. Now we have some clearer weather. Got into some dry clothes. Now we're just walking the streets. This looks like the main street, I would assume. I don't know what the name of this street is. As far as the COVID situation, from what I gathered, it seems like Georgia has either relaxed a bit when it comes to COVID, because a lot of places you go, uh, you see some people wearing masks, other people not wearing masks. Yeah. Um, to enter the country, you had to have a PCR test or proof of vaccine. Georgian people, we need you to explain this. We see these things everywhere, these little machines, right? You translate it into English and it seems like you guys have everything at one little kiosk. You can bet, you can load up your mobile phone, pay your water bill. I, we don't know. Pay what? your phone bill. Yeah. Put well, some money on your bus card. Yeah, Maybe everything. even call a taxi. Looks What's like you can help taxi? Ukraine from here too. You can even donate money to Ukraine right here. Woo. That's cool. <laughs> Oh gosh, this is this is crazy. All right, so, Georgian people in the comment section, please explain to us what is happening here, so we can pay our water bill. Gas. We need this in America. We need this in Turkey. Look, we need this in America. Trump, I mean not Trump, Biden. If you're listening, we need this. Call the president of Georgia. Tell him we need one of these. showing off his new scarf and he's drunk and he's cute <laughs> stop it get some help booty drums is about to drop their new single it's gonna be a smash a smash hit I'm their manager Lester 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 say it two times now, listen, Booty Jones, hot new band, great, they have amazing songs, great riff.